Hey gang, Ross Brand here for LivestreamUniverse.com. Here's your update for Wednesday, November 16th, 2016. What it, what it means the most to me, I suppose, is the fact that I did get there. I was able to stay consistent and, and hopefully provide a lot of valuable content for people. Congratulations to Chris Barrows for reaching episode number 100 of the YI Social Podcast from Average Joe to CEO. Chris has interviewed many of the people who are active as live streamers, internet broadcasters, podcasters, social media professionals, people in the higher education world. And Chris says to get to 100, consistency is key. You know, for me, reaching episode 100 uh, is really just about consistency. I talk about it a lot and I, I always say, you know, for someone to be successful in what they do, they have to do it consistently. You can't quit on something after, you know, three tries or four tries. You got to just kind of keep going at it. So uh, for me, that's what it's about. And for the 100th episode, Mary Alice Barrow. Yes, that's Chris's wife is the guest. She talks about her role in getting the podcast started as well as her work in higher education and social media. And Chris says there have been a lot of benefits of hosting a podcast. Podcasting has benefited me in a lot of ways, but the, the greatest benefit I, I, I hope was mutual, which is people. And it's connecting with so many new people that I would have never met. And uh, the, the other benefit really has been uh, these amazing relationships that I, I believe have helped my career tremendously. So I'm grateful to all those people who have got to meet through podcasting, who've later given me opportunities, whether it be to speak or do a webinar. Um, recently, Zoom flooding, we do a webinar is just one of the examples. But uh, that's that's meant the world and been a great benefit for me. With 100 episodes out of the way, I asked Chris what to expect for the next 100 episodes. Next 100 episodes, you know, I, I'm hoping to do a few more specials in there, a few more unique pieces of content, and otherwise stay really focused on the average Joe over the CEO. I think I went a little back and forth in the first 100, especially early on, and I saw that the average Joe was the people want, people wanted to learn about, uh, people who normally don't get their time behind a mic or in front of a camera. And these are people, quite frankly, who are doing the real work at most organizations. So those are the people who deserve to be highlighted, and those are the people who I hope to continue to highlight with obviously a few nice names thrown in there. That's where I see it going over the next 100 episodes, and hopefully uh, hopefully I reach number 200. Again, congratulations to Chris Barrows on reaching episode 100. His wife, Mary Alice Barrows, is the guest, and you can find episode 100 of the Why I Social podcast on iTunes, SoundCloud, Lisbon, wherever you like to listen to fine podcasts near you at 3 p.m. Eastern. It's the Let's Live Stream Twitter chat at hosted by Rachel Moore, moderated by Jen Nelson, looking at OBS versus Wirecast, the comparison of two of the major live streaming encoding tools. And you can find that on Twitter, where, of course, all Twitter chats are held. It's also a version on Periscope as well. Hashtag Let's Live Stream to follow along the chat at 3 p.m. Eastern. Also at 3 p.m. Eastern, it's the dojo. Our favorite Queen Ninja guru, RJ Redden, is hosting Are You Really That Sorry? A guide for stopping sorry in its tracks. 3 p.m. Eastern on Facebook Live. You can find it on the Queen Ninja Guru page. At 4 p.m. Eastern, it's the show.live with Mitch Jackson and Jen Hoverstead. Their guest is 17-year-old motivational speaker Brandon Farbstein. What an interesting life story he has of determination and overcoming obstacles. And what a great speaker. Should be a fascinating episode. Again, 4 p.m. Eastern, the show.live. You can find it on Facebook Live and Huzzah. At 5 p.m. Eastern, a different time today. Just for this episode, Stacey Lynn Harp will be hosting Bible News Radio at 5 p.m. Eastern. Her guest is your friendly dog trainer, the leading online dog training mentor, April Bolivar, joins Stacy on Periscope at 5 p.m. Eastern, periscope.tv slash Bible News Radio. At 9 p.m. Eastern, it's everyone's favorite variety show. It's the Jenny Q Show, Variety at its finest. And her special guest tonight, Kathy Klotz, comic speaker and author. Also, Nicole Kuhn, Target Store uh, team lead, who will be talking about which toys are the most popular going off the shelf this holiday season. Candy reviewer, Miss Candy Blog, and of course, trainer Glenn Dawson round out the crew for the Jenny Q Show. That's 9 p.m. Eastern on Facebook Live. 
And we wrap up the evening's programming with Vicki Fitch Live, A Fresh Perspective. Her special guest is Dinesh Agarwal. He's a research scientist turned entrepreneur. You can find that on Facebook Live again, 10 p.m. Eastern for Vicki Fitch. And we have a podcast version now of the daily live stream update. We'll love it if you would subscribe, rate, and review it. If you enjoy this broadcast, you can simply go to livestreamuniverse.com slash iTunes, and that'll take you right to the iTunes location where you can subscribe. And, of course, if you're looking for links to any of the shows in our update, you can find those on our Facebook page, facebook.com slash livestreamuniverse in the comments section underneath the original video post, again, on our Facebook page. And that is our update for Wednesday, November 16th, 2016. For LivestreamUniverse.com, I'm Ross Brand. Have a great day, everyone.